In version 2.7 we have new enhancements for 3D macro creation. We can define identical reference points and move them afterwards to a new position without deleting and replacing. We will create a new layout space for this demo. Change the project type to a macro project. Insert a device. In this video we will use a standard relay. Zoom in. Insert two base points. Click edit and then device logic. Select the name, user supplementary point one. Add the second base point. Select the name as before, user supplementary point one. In the older versions ePlan would have cancelled placing a second base point with the same name. In version 2.7 a dialogue asks the user if he want to place it nevertheless. We will confirm with yes. To move one base point it was necessary to delete and replace it. In version 2.7 it is possible to move the point easily by using the move action. Select one base point and select move. You can move mounting points as easy as base points too. I will demonstrate it. Select the mounting point. Select move. You can now move the mounting point to its new position. If you want to move a handling point of a macro, you can move it the same way as I already demonstrated. <laughs> 